If you're creating a workbook for other people to use in Excel, you can add a text box with instructions to help them get started. So on the Insert tab, click Text Box, drag to make a text box of a specific size. If you adjust the size, the text wraps automatically to show a little bit less on each line and fill that text box. But if the text box gets too small, some of the text might be chopped off and they might not see some crucial information that is lower down in that text box. If I want to make sure that all the text shows up, I can set the text box to resize automatically. With the text box selected, right click on the border and click Format Shape. I'll click Text Box and there's a checkbox here to auto fit and it will resize to fit the text. Click that and click Close. Everything is visible now and if I add more text the box would expand automatically to fit but we've lost the wrap text. I could add some line breaks of my own but that's the only workaround using Excel 2007. So if you're using Excel 2010 there's a wrap text feature that's been added. Here we have Excel 2010 open, a text box sitting on the worksheet, and we can see that it's chopped off at the end, so some of the text isn't visible. Right click on the text box and click Format Shape. And again, we'll go to Text Box. It looks very similar to what we saw in 2007. So there's Resize Shape, but now we can also set it to wrap the text within that shape. I'm going to click Resize Shape and Close, and it didn't widen that text box so it will all fit across. If I drag a corner handle, it keeps the width that I adjusted to, but makes it tall enough to fit all the text. If I change the font size, it gets taller to fit everything. So you can adjust with the width handle or the corner handle. However, if you drag the bottom or top handles, that turns off the auto sizing. So now that we've done that, if we go back into the format shape on the text box, we can see that was automatically turned off because we dragged the, either the bottom or the top handle. If you have a workbook with lots of text boxes that you want to change these settings on, you could use a macro. And I've created one that we can see here in Visual Basic. It has a variable for shape and worksheet. And then it just runs through each worksheet in the active workbook, worksheets. For each shape on that worksheet, it looks at the text frame sets the auto size to shape to fit text and turns the word wrap to true. I'll just click in here and click the run button and now each text box or each shape that has text in it like this rectangle would have that setting changed. Visit the Contextures website and there is a sample file that you can download with the code to change the text box auto sizing.